Hello. There's um, two types of business on this planet. There's no three types of business on this planet. There's just two types of business on this planet. I suppose the third type is the ones that are crossing over from one to the other. You know. I suppose you know you can say there's three types of business. I suppose. So you've got the investors. These are the companies that aren't selfish. So you've got the boss at the top. And he understands that even if his sons and daughters don't get to run the business, the business is for the betterment of society. And then you've got the selfish bosses who, if they can't have what the business is going to give in the future, then they don't see why they should leave it to the future. Even if the sons and daughters get it. So the investors will know that we've got machines that work, but see an emerging market somewhere, emerging market somewhere, and they'll they'll invest. They'll buy expensive machinery that doesn't seem to be needed right now, or buy or invest in expensive new technologies let's say, that don't seem to be needed right now, but in 10 or 20 years time they come into their own. But then you've got the other bosses who try to drag every last little bit out of the old technology, even when the new technology is there, and it's quite clearly better, that will make more people work to do less, as much as they can, and pay them less as well, pay more people less, and sack them continuously try to get them out because they realise the people that are working are working miles too hard now and they're, they're flat in health and safety laws everywhere because of lack of investment and the government don't help this neither because sometimes companies want to invest but they need a little bit of planning permission and the government won't give them planning permission because of heritage laws or because some um, mayor or some council leader doesn't like the business owner, like Richard Branson tried to put a high speed, high speed rail link in from London to Scotland about 10-15 years ago. Now they're going to do it, but they wouldn't let Richard Branson do it. They don't like Richard Branson, so they've held him back. I hope that explains it for you. It's not just companies that don't want to invest, and business owners that don't want to invest. Sometimes it's the government that don't want the business owners and won't let those business owners invest. And that's where I lie. They won't let me invest in my future. The people around me will not let me invest in my future because I want to be single. So they just don't let me invest in my future. And I just say, well, fuck you. If you're not going to let me invest in my future, well, how can I invest in your future if I'm not going to invest in my future? All right? You understand? I hope you're understanding what that means. So you can just talk to the wall, you understand? It's just might as well start talking to the wall now. Yeah? Because you wouldn't let me invest in my future. Piss off. Piss off. Fuck off. Uh, wash, clean, brush teeth. Levenses. I don't know, I'm laughing at some fucking women that are dressed up, dressed up nicely and they're like, ooh, and I go, fuck off. <laughs> Silly cows, tell. New tell. Fucking leader. Tell. You're a tell. <sighs> fuck off. <laughs> fuck off, fuck off.
No, I better not do that, I know. That would have been too clever. Walk in front of there naked. That would not be clever at all. What shall I have I got? I'm going to find some woman psychiatrist. <laughs> oh, too late. <laughs> Bleeding for nothing. Fuck's sake. Do nothing, I was just walking. So I've got nosebleed from nothing again. Thirty-six. Got a nosebleed from nothing again. Not happy. Thirty-six. Thirty-six. I can get a nosebleed. Wow! Wow! <laughs> well, turn it off. I'm sweating. An hour to ten degrees in an hour. Not bad. Not bad. Yep, same clothes on again. It's important to washing clothes if I'm just going to sit in front of the computer all day and do fuck up. Blood. <laughs> 